Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. Typing a new note into OneNote is just one option for getting content into a OneNote notebook. Existing content from other sources such as the web or Microsoft Word or Excel can be copied or cut and pasted into your notebook. We'll have some different paste options that we'll examine as well. First, select the content that you want to copy in OneNote. For example, in a Microsoft Word document as we see here, you can use any of the available options to select the specific text you want. You can click and drag to select specific content, for example. You could choose Control plus A to select all of the content and so forth. And then copy it using the keyboard shortcut Control C or once you've selected the text you can select copy from the home tab in the ribbon in Microsoft Word. So we'll go up here and select copy. Then in the OneNote application, so we'll switch back here, you choose the notebook page or create a new page into which you wish to paste the content and then select the home tab in the ribbon if it's not already selected. Now if you simply click the paste button in the ribbon or use the keyboard shortcut control P you'll accept the default paste option. So we'll go ahead and look up here into the home tab and we see paste here so we can click that and you'll see that we have a few options. So we can click the button at the top or we can click the drop down there. Now that small downward pointing arrow just under the paste button reveals the drop down and the different choices. The current default will be listed as the first paste option right here which is keep source formatting but you can choose any of the available paste options by giving the corresponding button a click. Now if you hover your mouse over these options a screen tip will be shown telling you the type of paste option. Keep Source Formatting, which is our first option here, will paste the contents into the note and retain all of the text formatting from the source document. We also have Merge Formatting, which will combine the formatting from the source document and the page into which you are pasting the note contents. Then we have Keep Text Only, which will retain the text only and strip out any formatting from the source document. Finally, you could select Picture, which will save the content as an image. Now keep in mind if you select this option, you will not be able to edit the content later. We'll go ahead and just keep the source formatting, give that a click, and you'll see that it pastes the information right in there for us. So that's how you copy and paste content into your OneNote pages. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.